Hello, Blanca. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. I finished finishing dinner. Oh, okay. Cooking or eating? Mm, eating, eating. Okay, okay. No problem. Finish eating. Relax. No problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Christina, how are you? Cristina, you there? Okay. Nazario, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? So good. I'm great. Wonderful. Hey, hey excellent. Glad to hear what that. About, what about you, teacher? I'm doing how, amazing. Oh, how was your day? Really good day. A lot of activities, completed many tasks. I like the days where I feel that I did a lot of things. That's wonderful. It's wonderful to have a great day, teacher. Mm -hmm. And you, Nazario, how was your day? I feel so good, teacher. What I did went you do to today? Uh, in an early morning, I woke up around 7 a.m. I took a shower. <laughs> took my breakfast, uh, I went to work. I was in the office around 6.30 a.m., maybe. Mm -hmm. And I went to work to Chachuapa City. Okay. Ciudad, it's called La Ciudad de la Yuca. Did you hear? Ciudad de la Yuca, huh? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, close to El Tazumal. Ah, okay. Yeah, it was a very busy day and i returned to my house around at once at 1 p.m i think so okay uh during the afternoon i went to play soccer and i went to i run a little bit and i come back to my house around 4 or 4 30 p.m maybe take another shower i was watching tv I was watching some kind of videos in internet about planet Earth and wildlife and different kind of things that I try to do every day. And do you go running every day? Do you play soccer every day? Uh, no, at least uh, three times a week, maybe. Maybe okay. maybe Monday, uh, Thursday, and, and Sundays. Too. Okay. Hey, it's a great way to stay active. Yeah, it's true. We have to do this. Show. Yeah. Before exactly. health, before health, we were talking yesterday about health problems. So the exercise is so good for us. Mm -hmm. Exactly. All right. Well, I'm super excited to have so many people here. We are ready to begin. Um, any questions about the platform? Remember, we are already in unit two. Unit one should be complete. We are beginning today. 2.7, 2.7. So any questions from unit one or 2.1 2 or through 2.7? No? All right. No, sure. Doesn't sound like any questions. So let's get started. We have a lot of activities to do. We want to make sure we complete it. So let's take a look. Uh, Nazario, can you do me the favor, please? and read yeah. the instructions. What is the objective? That's right, I'm gonna do. In this session, you will listen to vocabulary related to containers, following this part, uh, a conversation between a pharma pharmacist and a customer will take place. Model birth for requests and suggestions are introduced. Okay, so we're gonna learn a little bit about model verbs which is important, as well as the idea of pharmacist. 
Now, pharmacist is the person, right? Pharmacy is the place. Many times the pharmacy we confuse, but is also in the United States, a drugstore. They have two names, pharmacy or a drugstore. Hmm. That's right. All right, let's watch a small video that we have. Containers and suggestions. Hi, ready to begin? In the conversation we're about to listen to, we will introduce modal verbs for suggestions and requests. Please practice the conversation with a classmate or a friend, as it is important to repeat for better understanding. Listen and practice. Hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? Okay. Let's take a look here. First, are there any words that you don't understand? Anything you're not sure about? No, all of the vocabulary is okay. I think that for me it's okay, teacher. I don't know with right. another classmate. I think maybe yes, a lot of classmates are, are quiet. So let's listen and make sure that we understand with good fluency and intonation. Blanca Guadalupe and Carla. Blanca is going to be the pharmacist and Carla is going to be Mrs. Webb. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cold? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, are you, you guys about of the this couch drop? Thank you. And what do you su suggest for dry skin? Three some of this new lotion. It is very good. Okay, and one more thing. This my husband has no energy these days. Can you su help, suggest anything? He should drink some of the these multivitamins. They are excellent. Great. May I may I have three large bottles, please? Thank you. Thank you both for for making the effort. Great job. We're gonna have a few words for everybody to pronounce. Okay. Here is cough, like with an F. Cough. Cough. Here is suggest suggest, suggest. Mm -hmm. suggest. good and then towards the bottom is multi no multi multi vitamins multi vitamins multi vitamins multi correct multi 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 vitamins vitamins uh -huh. no like in spanish right no multi multi Multi's vitamins. Excellent. So in this moment, what are we going to do is we're going to be focusing on our fluency. If you see here, we have the audios. I'll put it right here for you. We we'll start. Hi, may I help you? Okay. So as you can see, it starts at 22, right? And it goes over here almost to one. So whoop, a little bit less. He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? Okay. So if you can see from 22 to 58, it's just a little bit over 50, over 35 seconds. So what I want you to do is for you and your partners to focus 
and to try and improve our fluency. How are we going to improve the fluency? You want to have the conversation in 40 seconds, okay? So how long? The maximum, oh yes, Lil, the pronunciation, cough, cough. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sure. Sorry, I just, saw the, I just saw the chat, sorry Lil. Yes, cough, mm -hmm. okay. So we want to practice and you and your partners want to complete the conversation. You want to complete it in 40 seconds. Okay, I'll give you a few moments to practice. You'll have a few minutes to practice with your partner, but the objective is 40 seconds, the two. Are we ready? I'm yes. ready. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. Um, let me see. I think that is, uh, we have, hang on one more time. Only Christina is going to be listening. So we need to change her. And by the way, it's very, it's very good if sometimes you have a problem and you can't participate in the class and only listen is really, is it helps me a lot when you put in your name, oyente. That way I know that for the for that day is not a problem. And then I don't put you into the groups. Mm -hmm. That way we try the other ones. So let me just move it and move this person. All right, let's practice. Vivian, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Everything okay? Yes. Okay, great. I'm going to put you into the group right now, okay? Okay, thank you. Yep. Luisana? Okay, Lisa, and I'm gonna move the other partner. That way she can practice. If you join later, we'll try to fix it. Lisa, you're having some problems, huh? Luisana? Good evening. Good evening, Luisana. Okay. Hello, Douglas. Estoy teniendo problemas de conexión. No problem. Uh, let's take a look. Douglas, are you there? Yes, I am. Okay. So, Luisana, puede ver la pantalla? Yes. Yes? Okay. Douglas, can you see the screen? Yes. Okay, perfect. Let's practice. Luisana, you are the pharmacist, and Douglas, you are Mrs. Webb. Go. Luisana. Luisana. Me escuchan. Ahora sí. Go ahead, Luisana. Ah, perdón. Hi, may I help you? 
Yes, please. Who will have something for a call? I think I am getting a call. Well, I saw it a box of these coke drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of these the of of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy this day. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Right. May I have three large bottles, please? Okay, Douglas, Luciana, thank you very much. We have to work on the fluency, um, the two of you, very nice job, but it's too slow, too slow. Practice reading, recording, try to get faster, that way you can get better, okay? Okay. Excellent. All right, Luciana, uh, Douglas, select the next person. Who is the next person? Um, Alba. 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 Okay, Alba. Who was your partner, Alba? Alba? Mm -hmm. I'm looking in here, but maybe Alba. Over here, Alba. Alba Luz Mendez. Okay, guys, you are there or no, Alba? Who was Alba's partner? Alba? No. All right, let's take a look. Let me see. Okay. Okay. So Alba, Jonathan, and Carla were the partners, correct? Uh -huh. Pronunciation, Lil? Multivitamins. Multivitamins. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Alba, Jonathan, Carla, Eugenia, Hernandez. Hi. Hi, teacher. Okay. Uh, did you speak with Alba or no? No. 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 I know. Okay. No. All right. Maybe Alba has some problems. I forgot. Remember to put the idea. Uh -huh. uh, let me put this in Spanish to make sure it's clear. Okay. Uh, no hay ningún problema si ustedes tienen un inconveniente o no pueden participar, sino que lo mejor es si tienen... Si no pueden participar, hágame el favor de poner al principio de su nombre oyente para que así, eh, porque son un montón y yo sé que a veces dicen, Co teacher, yo no voy a poder participar y está bien, pero si me hacen el favor de poner oyente al principio de su nombre y así los tomo en cuenta cuando hacemos los grupos o cuando estamos participando para saber que estás trabajando, estás ocupada, está, cualquier cosa, puede ser manejando, lo que sea. Pero así no estamos perdiendo el tiempo buscando, tratando de que la persona hable y se conecte. ¿Ok? No hay ningún problema, como le digo, no hay ningún problema que sean oyentes. Le, lo importante es solo para notificar, porque se hace mucho más fácil llevar el control de quién es que no puede participar y quién sí. Ok. So, Carla, Jonathan, you are ready? Yes, yeah. I'm ready. All right. Carla, you are the pharmacist now. I am Mr. Webb. Okay. Hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I saw that a box, a box of this cold drop. Thank you. And what do you do suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay, and one more thing. And one more thing, my husband has no energy these days. 
can you suggest anything? I know. He, he, he <laughs> showed three some of this. Multiple, they, they're excellent. Great, may I have three large bottles, please? Okay, pretty good, very good. Uh, almost, very, almost exactly on time, very nice. Only the pronunciation of a couple of words. Remember the words are cough, cough oh. drops, uh-huh, for cough, cough drops. Cough drops. Good, suggest. So that's. No, no su, no su, sa, oh, suggest. Stop. Subjects. Adjust. Correct. And multi, no multi, multi vitamins. Multi vitamins. Excellent. All right. Perfect. Then any volunteers, any group? Anybody want to practice with their partner? Sure. Rodrigo. Wow. Great. And who was your partner, Rodrigo? Um, Carlos. All right, Rodrigo, volunteer Carlos. Excellent, I love it. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Call. I have something for a call. I think I'm gonna get a call. A call. Well, I suggest a box of this cock drop. Thank you. And what do you suggest for a dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My girlfriend has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multi multivitamins. They are excellent. Great. May I have three layer boroughs, please? Excellent. Very nice. Only one pronunciation, husband. The pronunciation was husband. Right here, husband. Okay, good. Well, I love it. I love the fact that we have several people participate. Anybody else? One more or no? One more volunteer? Me, teacher, but uh, we are three. It's okay. Let's do it. Carlo, okay. who is your partner? Francisca and I don't, I don't remember. Who? Vivian. And Vivian, sorry. Okay. So the first, Carla and Francisca, pharmacist Mrs. Webb, and then Francisca and William, the change, the uh, change, or you and William, okay? Okay, teacher, Vivian. Okay. <laughs> Okay. okay, Francisca. Okay, I get it. Yes. Um. Hi, my. May I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a call. Well, I suggest a box of these of cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some some of this new new lotion. Uh, it's very good. Okay, and one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these, some of the multi, multivitamins. There is excellent. I mean, they're Great. excellent. Great. May I, have, may I have three large bottles, please? Ladies, very nice job. Very nice job. Good pronunciation overall. A little bit of the fluency we need to improve for some pauses, but good job. Excellent. And then the next with well, uh, Vivian, who's going to practice with Vivian? Okay. Um, Me, maybe? Okay. Vivian, pharmacy or Mr. Webb? Okay. Hi, may, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a call? I think I'm getting a call. Well, I'll suggest... Um, um, a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of things new lotion is very good. Okay, and one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multi 
multivitamin. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? Okay, thank you very much. Um, Vivian, just a little bit of working on the fluency. You are pausing after the words. Remember, try not to pause after the words, but pause at the end. And one more time, the pronunciation is multivitamins. Multi. Multivitamins. Correct. Multivitamins. Thank you. Multivitamins. Multi no, no, no tea, no tea. Multi. Multi. Multivitamins. 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 Sorry, yeah. Okay, multivitamins. Okay, let's go with multivitamins. All right. So, uh, we are ready to continue? Okay, perfect. Let's take a look at the next one. Blanca Guadalupe, can you tell us what are we going to practice now? In this part, in this part, participants will be introduced to the use the mother bears can called my four for question su suggestions. Okay, good. Very good. Everybody with pronunciation can, could, can, may, could, may. Okay, for requests and suggestions. These are models. So always when we have models, we're going to use the verbs in the present. Here we're going to learn a little bit about the difference between can, could, may. Okay. Hello, everyone. This time we will be introduced to the model verbs can, could, may for suggestions and requests. Modal verbs can, could, may for requests. Suggestions. Can I help you? May I help you? Can I have a box of cough drops? Could I have something for a cough? May I have a bottle of aspirin? What do you suggest for dry skin? What do you have for dry skin? Try some of this lotion. I suggest some ointment. You should get some skin cream. Okay. So, as you can see, we use very common words to ask when you are at the doctor, when you are at the pharmacist, when you are at the store. The formal is may, right? Like when in the school, if you remember in the school, the teachers say, no, 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 no. May I go to the bathroom? May I? This is the formal. But the normal is can and could. Hey, may I borrow your pen? Can I borrow your pen? Could I borrow your pen? The three, the same ideas. You are requesting, okay? Only remember that the difference is may. May is the most formal, okay? Then we have the ideas for suggestions, right? We can always use the different words, should, try, um, or I suggest. Here, we're gonna continue watching the video. In this case, can, could, and may are being used in question form to suggest or give advice. This is how we use them. Model verb plus subject plus verb have plus complement plus question mark. Can I have eye drops? May I have an ointment? Could I have some aspirins? What I want you to do now is to write a sentence using each modal verb learned. Please write them in our discussion box. Okay. Before we go to the discussion... Can I have eye drops? Look at the grammar structure. The grammar structure is the modal, the person, and then we are going to use the verb have with what, okay? Similar, may I have, uh, may I have water? Can I have a soda? Uh, could I have mm, an aspirin, okay? It's okay, the usage can, may, and could? Yes, teacher. Okay, good, these are for, request all right 
So let's make sure that it's clear before we try to do our role play. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to practice using the different models. Can, could, may, have, try, suggest, or should. We're going to complete these conversations with our partners. There are three conversations, A and B, A and B, for the three, uh, for the three people. We're only going to have about five minutes because it's only one word that we need to write. For this is 2.11 in the platform. And with our partner, simple, we want to try the best option, okay? Let me just change a little bit so we can have, let me make sure, okay. 2.11, use the correct model. Raquel, are you having some problems? Okay. Let's take a look. Listen to four people talk to a pharmacist. Check each person's problem. One. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like something for my feet. I went on a long hike yesterday and my feet are really sore. I see. Why don't you try some of this ointment? You can put it on at night. It's very good for sore feet. I use it myself, actually. Two. Excuse me, I'm looking for something for a stomach ache. I see. How long have you had this problem? For a few days, and it's getting worse. I'll give you some pills to take for a few days. They should help. Take two of these three times a day with meals. Three. Can I help you? Yes. I just came back from London on a long flight and I'm having trouble sleeping. We have several things for that, including sleeping pills. But I suggest you try some of this herbal tea. It's very good for jet lag. Drink some before you go to bed at night. Thanks, I'll try it. I don't like taking sleeping pills. Four. Good morning. What can I do for you? Um, 
I need something for a burn. I burned my hand a little when I was cooking last night. Look here. Oh, yes. I'll give you some cream for it. After you put on the cream, place a bandage over it for a few days. You should be fine. Thanks. All right, who's got, let's see, number 1A. Who has number 1A? Can. Okay, can. Can I help you? Yes. Number 1B? Can. Can I have something for Cold. it to eyes? Can I have something? Again, can. Okay, all right. I heard somebody said could, maybe could. All right, we're going to check. Suggest. What about... A, sure. Suggest. 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 Good. What about number two? What do you? Suggest. Suggest, Suggest or have? Suggest. Have. Have. Uh, have? Yes. Suggest. <laughs> All right. No, what do you have? No Suggest. Problem. Teacher. Okay, we're going to check in just a second then. Okay, well, what about you? You try you, this ointment. You should do three. You should try. Four. Four. You should you try. Should try. Okay. All right. You should try this ointment. It's excellent. Number three. Can I have a box of bandages? Can I have a box of bandages? All right. Bandages, please. And what do you... Suggest, suggest for insomnia. For insomnia. Okay. The last one? Try. 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 Try some herbal tea. It's very relaxing. Let's take a look here. We're doing pretty good. We can use both may or can. The next one is correct. Can, could, or may, the three are correct, have the same meaning. So only suggest, here we can have two answers. We can use the word have or suggest are similar for this context, then should in number three, look, can, could, or may, then two options, have or suggest, and the last one, try. Now, the easy part is because with those models, you have the same meaning. Remember, it's the same meaning. You are requesting. The difference is formal and informal. It's okay, the three? Can, may, could? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher, it's okay. Okay, great. Now let's do a little bit of listening here. We are going to listen to a conversation of people at a pharmacist. We're going to listen to four people talking to our pharmacist. Choose each question. Choose each one that has the problem. Now, we're going to read it together to make sure it's correct. Uh, Carla, can you read number one? Carla Alvarenga, number one. And then Nazario, number two. Jonathan, number three. And then we are going to have Ever Antonio number four. Please read the two options. Okay. The man's feet are sore and the man's feet are itch, itchy, maybe? Itchy. Itchy. It's okay. What the itchy, Carla? Itch? Uh, like, look, no. look at the video. Look at me. Look at me. Uh, it's itchy. Uh, okay. 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 Good. Like like allergy? Yes, very good. Very good. Like allergy. When you have son, come son. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. What about number okay. two? Number two. Me. The the woman can't eat. The woman has an upset stomach. Good. So upset stomach is uh, -huh. Pan, uh she needs Pepto Bismol, Alka Seltzer, right? This is an upset stomach. Number three. 
The man has difficulty sleeping. The man has the man is sleeping too much. Good. Very nice. Okay. And the last one, number four. The woman born a born a her hand. The woman has a bad stumbling. Very good, ever. Only the pronunciation burned with D. Burned. Burned. Excellent. Excellent. Much better. Okay. So listen and select each one. What is the problem? Listen to four people talk to a pharmacist. Check each person's problem. One. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like something for my feet. I went on a long hike yesterday and my feet are really sore. I see. Why don't you try some of this ointment? You can put it on at night. It's very good for sore feet. I use it myself, actually. Two. Excuse me. I'm looking for something for a stomach ache. I see. How long have you had this problem? For a few days, and it's getting worse. I'll give you some pills to take for a few days. They should help. Take two of these three times a day with meals. Three. Can I help you? Yes. I just came back from London on a long flight, and I'm having trouble sleeping. We have several things for that, including sleeping pills. But I suggest you try some of this herbal tea. Hmm? It's very good for jet lag. Drink some before you go to bed at night. Thanks. I'll try it. I don't like taking sleeping pills. Four. Good morning. What can I do for you? Um, I need something for a burn. I burned my hand a little when I was cooking last night. Look here. Oh, yes. I'll give you some cream for it. After you put on the cream, place a bandage over it for a few days. You should be fine. Thanks. Okay. What is number one? One. The man's feet are sore. Okay, the man's feet are sore. And number two? The woman has, has um, used a stomach. stomach. Good. Everybody repeat. Upset. 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 Good. Stomach. 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 Correct. No che. No che. No upset. Stomach. 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 Good. That's Number three. The man has difficulty sleeping. Has difficult sleeping. Okay. And number four. A woman born in a woman in a Good. Remember the pronunciation. No burn it. Burned. Burn. Burn. Burned. 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 Correct. Burned. All right. Because he's the best. Very good, very good listening skills. Only listen one time and we have it. Any questions before we continue? All is clear. Okay, now we're gonna practice our role play. The final role play is you are talking to a person, the pharmacist, the doctor, and they're giving you suggestions. As an example, um, maybe I talk to my mom, my sister, ah, my father, right? It doesn't matter. The important is you are giving recommendations, suggestions, and you are explaining your medical problems. I, I, Blanca, I have insomnia. I can't sleep. Oh, Edwin, don't worry. Um, I suggest you try herbal tea. It helps you to relax. I, Blanca, I tried, but it didn't work. Okay, then you should try to do some exercise in the day or this is the idea, the conversation, okay? The problem, suggestion, explanation, why? Problem, insomnia, suggestion, okay? Recommendation, I function, didn't function, and why? This is, we want to have a conversation. It's okay? Okay. 
It's okay. Okay. It's good. Okay. Good. Okay. okay. Uh, before we before we make the groups, uh, everybody's okay. No, no questions for vocabulary. Can, may, could, should. No. Okay. Excellent. Let's make a few groups. Let's try it. Let me make sure we have the right people. Okay. And here, one moment. Okay. Okay. So we have two people that can't speak. Okay. Wonderful. Let's try it. Carlos, are you having some difficulties? I try again, Carlos. Carlos? Lillian? Lillian, are you okay? Lillian or Carlos? Hi, teacher. I have a problem with my internet. Okay, Lillian, no problem. And let me try to help you. Um, now, are you okay? You want to try one more time going to another group? Can you repeat, please? Yes. Uh, now we're going to try an, a different group. See if we can connect to a different group, okay? Okay. Okay, I send okay. you the invitation. Yeah. Okay, I send you in this moment.
Okay. Are we ready to participate? We're ready to present? Yeah, I'm ready. Excellent. All right. Jonathan, I love it. I love it. Jonathan and Juan Villanueva. Is that correct? Yeah. Excellent. All right, Jonathan and Juan. Well, let's let's go. Welcome, Juan. Welcome to my clinic. How can I help you? Tell me. I can hear Juan. Juan, okay. I can hear you. Hi. Oh, okay, okay. He okay. had a little microphone problem. No problem. Let's yeah. begin again, Jonathan. Begin one more right. time. Well, okay. let's go. Welcome, Juan. I'm John. Welcome to my clinic. Tell me, how can I help you? Hey, hi, Jonathan. Well, I need your help, to be honest, because I have a very bad headache. What do you recommend for that? For a backache, I suggest you try sleep uh, more or less eight hours, and you can try a uh, Spirina's bottle. I recommend this. Okay, but this is for a backache, right? Yeah, for the package. Okay, and let me tell you that I have a very bad headache. And what do you recommend for that? A bad itch, like a migraine. No. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think it's really well to be honest. I think you should try this home man of Florifundia. It's excellent okay. to migraines. You can feel the effect in instantly or actually i don't remember that the minimum of of immediato well okay instantly immediately. instantly immediately instantly okay well this is your all of your problems or you have another that's all my problems to be honest and take all my money and give me all the money <laughs> well i okay. recommend you buy your but you buy these recommendations at Value Farmers. And Value the next week, you can tell me if my suggestions are, are better or not better. Not okay, better. I'm going yeah. to tell you. Thanks, well, Jonathan. I hope to see you. Thanks. It's all.
Hey, hey, very nice, very creative. I thought it was very funny. I like the idea of Florifundia. Hey, <laughs> very happy with Florifundia. Ah, yes, I saw. <laughs> what happened, man? What happened, guys? <laughs> exactly, exactly. Very Come nice. on, take it easy. Uh -huh. Today's hey, Thursdays, at least. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's try the next one. Who is the next one? Mm, let's go with Blanca and Carla. Sure. Carla, hello. Hi, teacher. Hello, Blanca. Uh, hello, Eugenia. I have a problem. Exercise. Hi, Blanca. Have a good attitude and discipline uh, as well as a good diet. All right. But, but the problem is that my bones hurt. Any medicine? Oh yeah, you have to do long impact exercise like yoga or dance. Okay, thank you. I can do you the yoga very easily. Thank you for your help me. You're welcome, Blanca. Thank you very much. Very nice. Getting much better. Only the pronunciation easily. 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 Mm -hmm. Easily. Good. And thank you for helping me. Thank you for helping me. Thank you. Thank, thank, thank you, you for helping me. Yes. Okay. okay, great. Hey, the next we have Douglas, uh, Nazario, and Lillian. Wonderful. Hi Lilian, hi Douglas. Hi Nazario. Hi Nazario. How are you? I'm gonna be your doctor today. I feel very bad. I think I am allergic to seafood. Oh, and that's right. Today, yes, um, today I ate for the lunch. Uh, what do you recommend me? In the lunch, what did you eat, Douglas? A shrimp. What did you eat in, in the lunch? Seafood? Yeah, I ate a shrimp. Oh, yeah. Well, Douglas, uh, I'm going to suggest that you, you should drink some antacid and drink a lot of liquids and do you have a headache Douglas? I'm sorry? Do you have a headache? Um, no. No? It's, on, it's only your stomach? Yeah. Oh that's right. Um, go to the, the pharmacy and, and you can buy some antacid please and and you should to drink three times a day, please, during one week. Okay. Thank That's you right. for your help. Me. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You should, you should be better tomorrow. Thank you. Okay, Lily, I'm going to be your, uh, the, the six people, maybe. Okay. I suggest that that he takes some medicine and passes, ah. but, but he needs to take a rest and take a lot of water. By the way, uh, Lil, uh, I have a sore muscle. What do you suggest for me today? Okay, I suggest that you need uh, to need to some um, um, I don't remember how do you say cream cream ointment cream <laughs> yes ointment ah, that's right thanks my doctor you are my favorite doctor <laughs> okay thank you very much very good please remember that we don't take water, uh, we drink water, 
um, and we can get the for many of the medications as well. Okay, so good, very good. Only be careful with the vocabulary for the medicines. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Thank you so much. Great. That Wonderful. Both of you. All right. Let's take a look. We still have a couple groups left. Uh, who is next? Um, we have Francisca Luciana or Vivian and Carlos. Francisca and Luciana. Okay, Francisca and Luciana. No problem. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, hello. Uh, can you help you? Yes, doctor. Well, doctor, I feel very tired. To be honest, always, always, I can't sleep at night. So I would like to have any comments about the insomnia. Uh, can I suggest anything? <laughs> okay, I suggest take a pill. You drink a tea of chamomilla and you can be relaxed to listen to classical music. Okay, doctor. Thank you, because I'm very, very tired. Thank you. Yes, and you uh, try the... Uh, uh, sorry. <laughs> um, you can be relaxed in your body. You... For the night. <laughs> okay, thank you for helping of nothing. <laughs> no. That's it, teacher. Sorry. No, no problem. No problem. Thank you very much. The important mistakes are okay. The important is to improve and to get better the next time. Thank you very much. Okay. We have who is next? We have uh, Ever and, and Lil or Carla and Rodrigo. Okay, Ever and Lil, let's go for it. Hi, Ever, how are you? Ever, the microphone. Hi, Lil. Uh, so bad, I have a flu. And yes. You can try with acetaminophen every eight hours. Right. Can you accommodate other? Medicine? You can try with ibuprofen or no se como se dice. No problem. Ibuprofen. Ibuprofen every 12 hours for one day. Hey, thanks. I sold you. I sleep early. Um, you can drink chamomile tea every, every night before sleep. Right, thanks for telling me. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you very much, Lil and Ever. Good job in the vocabulary. We have to work a little bit more on the fluency. Guys, it is time. Thank you so much. We are working very hard, but oof, finish unit two, Monday, begin unit three. And then we have review and exam next week. So relax, that's Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Spanish. And then Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, so once English, okay. We have to practice every day, teacher. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Good night. I see you on Monday. Good night. Thank you. Bye. See you, class Bye. Bye. Have a nice weekend. Thank you, teacher. See you. Good night. Bye. Have a nice weekend. You too.